morning and welcome to beautiful Cozumel Island down here in Quintana Roo, Mexico. Rachel and I are going to be fishing on the second biggest reef in the world trying to get her her first mahi-mahi. We are headed to the north end of the island out here with Makaira Cozumel Fishing Charter and Captain Jose. If you're interested in checking this gentleman out, I highly suggest you do so. There is a link in the description of the video down below. That's all I got for you. It's time to do a little bit of fishing. One of the things that I enjoy most in life is the sunrise like that out on the water. Beautiful blue water. I'm going to be really honest. I feel really bad because I'm not doing any of the work. Yeah, I know. I feel the same way. Right? It's also kind of like... I have, I have it on me, don't I? Yes, you do. You can. Can I flip it now? You can. Hi. I mean, my face is in the way. still you. It's still me? It's still you. I gotta get practice again. And here we go with the nice transition. Wow, that was a smooth transition. Yeah, I don't know. I just don't like how that feels. Wow. Okay. Well, that's good. Yeah, that's good. Thank you. 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 Thank and I have a feeling that's gonna get shut down real fast. <laughs> this boat is insane, especially for me. There's the cabin. Paul's used to having to work for his fish, and when we go out with Paul Sr., I'm happy to work for mine as well. But it's vacation, and I think I'm gonna sit back and enjoy it. So we're coming out here to the shelf and we're going to drop down and see what we can find on the bottom. Yeah, 250 feet deep. It's going to be a workout on the old guns. <laughs> down here at Cozumel. He's gonna get it. He's sitting right there. 
<laughs> All well, I know was, is that was a big damn fish. That was our last spot and yeah, you got to fight the whole time. That's <laughs> oh yeah yeah. yeah. He's saying it's a probably was a big amber Oh yeah. Oh no no no. Just him just Roberto saying that is like oh We got some we got some B liner vermilion. Okay, cool, right here. That was mine. <laughs> <laughs> So that was one of the all-time best charter experiences I think I've ever had in my life. Absolutely. If you are coming down to Cozumel and you want to do a little fishing, you yeah, absolutely is. got to get in touch with Jose and Roberto. Those guys are awesome. Yeah, they were super like patient and agreeable because I was the one that was like, I want my best. So oh yeah. He was super nice. Like, the smartest thing you can do on a trip like that is just say, you go fishing, I'll work for you. Yeah, they've been fishing their whole life. But I, I know really, really, really wanted mahi. I know it's nice. Rachel did not get her first mahi. I'm We're gonna have to it. keep working on that. And they suggested we come down here to La Monina. This is where they suggest getting our catch cooked up. So that's what we're gonna do. Yeah, they're from the island, they know us. Yes, exactly. As if this experience couldn't get any better, we get to sit here and dine with this in the background. That's our view. And we're going to have these guys over at Manina cooking up our food. They're going to give us some baked grouper and they're going to fry up that snapper for us. Perfect. Man, thank you, sir. This is habanero pepper, okay? Perfect. Oh, I love habanero. Yeah. <laughs> I like this. This sounds so gross. <laughs> I can tell from the smell. You? Oh my god. <laughs> you can tell. Oh my god, it is so good. Strawberry fruit, nonetheless. It tastes like strawberries. <laughs> I knew it'd be good, but I didn't know it'd be bad. I knew it would be time for us to move on to the next adventure. If you haven't already, you can check out all of our Cozumel videos right up here, and we have the next one coming up right down there. Thank you so much for joining. We will check you in the next video.